Hi guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new. My name is Ebony. I hope you are all new faces um, because this is a giveaway. I'm going to review the Jaclyn Hill vault. Now, I did get them singly. They didn't come in the vault box, but there is every palette here. At Ulta, they didn't get the vault. They only got the singles, but I was lucky enough to get myself a set to review and also a set to to give away to one of you guys so i will have all of the information listed in the down bar below but basically this is for my subscribers so make sure you are a subscriber i definitely will be checking um and there will be a couple other things i will tell you guys at the end i am wearing one of these on my eyes today it is the armed and gorgeous palette this is the one that i was most excited about the color story on this one i think is my favorite out of all of them because of the green in it so it comes just like this, packaged in the box. Jacqueline's face is on the back of this guy. Um, I know it's on the back of the box set as well. And then each one of them has the silver explosion and then also um, a color that kind of, a color that coincides with the colors that are in the palette. It does have a mirror, which is exciting because I know that people begged her for a mirror in the big palette and I think cost-wise it just couldn't work. This is upside down, but here is the color story here. I think this will be my go-to. I did use this guy wet today on the lid. It didn't really change the integrity of the powder, but I did want to at least use one, swatch them a little bit, use them on my eyes to make sure it was something that I did love and I wanted to give away here on my channel. So this one has six matte and four shimmer shades. Um, I did toss this guy into the crease. This is the shade Access. Um, and then in the outer V I used Secure and Agent. Um, so it's just a pretty warm look. Under the lash line I did use Top Secret, which is that olive color. I think that olive color is my favorite color out of all of the palettes um, in this collection. It's super, super pigmented and it doesn't have a ton of fallout because I know dark shades are hard to work with. Um, I know that most of you guys are probably here for the giveaway, so I'm gonna make this short and sweet. I'm gonna swatch a couple shades, a couple shimmers, and a couple mattes from each palette. So let's go in with Coin because that one is super intense. It's this guy here. So they are super, super pigmented, super foiled. I don't know if Morphe refers to their glitter shades as foiled shadows or as titanium, but they are super, super creamy, which I love. As creamy as a powder can be. Next, we're gonna swatch Access. That is that yellow shade, and I'm always on the hunt for a good yellow shade. That is this one here. I will say that it is super pigmented. On my skin tone, I did have to go in with a brush a couple times just because I am of a darker complexion. And then one that I would wanna see swatched if I was watching this video is VIP, which is this guy here. So I would say that that's the only color that doesn't really make sense to me in this palette, but I know having 40 shades, some I'm sure had to just be put in a palette because they didn't really match with any. So that is that one here. The next palette is the Ring the Alarm palette. Same photo of Jacqueline on the back. Um, same idea. This guy has like a red copperish color story to it. And it also has the red copper little speckles on it. Um, they do come packaged with a ton of bubble wrap too. So these will ship to you guys safely. This one looks like this. This is the color story for this one. This one reminds me a lot of some of the shades in the 3502 and the 35R. I feel like this one will probably sell out like first, um, but the colors are gorgeous. I'm gonna swatch this shade. It's called Bomb Ass. I mean, all right, love it. And these are just single swatches. I didn't go over any of them more than once. Let's do this one. It's called Alert. It's like a beautiful burnt orange. Love that shade. I'm ready for fall. I can't be the only one. So that is that guy there. That is beautiful. Let's do Secret. I like to see, you know, what the darkest shade in the palette swatch is like. The, they're so pigmented. So yeah, there's a couple swatches from that guy. I will say that most of the foil shades, 
do not have a ton of fallout, but that red, maybe I just swatched it a little hard. That red did have a little bit of fallout in it. Next is this guy. This is called Bling Boss. So it has those kind of violet reflex. And on the side, actually, it says the name of each one. So it looks like that. So this is the color story of this guy. It is your burgundies and your violets and your pinks. I will say I think that this one, all of the colors go with each other the best. Let's swatch Bling Bling. It's like a super pink champagne. Is that one there on the bottom? This one is called Sparks. I'm gonna swatch on the back of my hand now because I'm running out of room. So there is that guy. He is honestly the only one that I haven't loved so far, but let's give it another go. And I know that finger swatches don't mean much because you don't have primer on and you don't usually use your finger to put shadow on. So I will say definitely give all of these your own shot. And then I think I'm gonna swatch this buried treasure, which on the camera is coming off super purple in person. It's a little more brown. Oh my goodness, look at this. Look at that, it's so cool. It's like duochrome, it's like brown and purple. And it swatches like heaven. So that is that guy there. That one is, do you see that from over there? It is very pretty. And the last one we'll swatch from this guy is, how about Hush Hush? We haven't really done like a light transition color, but I will say that you could make a complete look out of any of these palettes for sure. This one reminds me of, um, Dusty Rose from Anastasia. And the last palette is the Dark Magic palette. This one, is intense and unlike anything I have, which is saying a lot because I have probably 60 palettes. These guys look just like this. This is so fun. I wish that this potion color was in the, I wish the green, the green color was in this palette. It would make more sense to me. If you're looking for a good black, I'm gonna swatch it and we will see how we feel about it. It's very buttery. Super, super pigmented with one swipe. That's not bad at all. Let's do Potion. I'm into greens. I love a good mossy green or olive green. So there is Potion. The last one we're gonna swatch is, I think Power Cut. I like the name of that. I don't know what it means, but it sounds like cutting shitty people out of your life to me. And there is that guy. So I would say, I mean, definitely consistent. If you look at the shades, like, the pigment is consistent in them. I am very proud to support a brand that will pull things from their shelves. And honestly, like, I know that they launched in Vegas early and they refunded the people and they gave them a special gift. Like, that's really cool because companies definitely don't have to do that and most of them don't do that. So, a brand with integrity is a big deal these days, especially because there's so many brands out there right now. Like, you know. So anyways, that is the Jaclyn Hill Vault. I am obsessed. Tell me in the comments below what your favorite palette is for the giveaway. Um, I usually have people ask me questions, but this time I think I would like to know because we're getting into the cooler months and mental health is a thing and depression is setting in, I'm sure for some people. So tell me what your favorite thing about yourself is, what you love most about yourself, what you're working on loving about yourself, and I will pick a winner one month from when this video goes up. I'll put the exact date in the info box below. It is US only. Please be over 18 or have your parents permission. If I do pick someone that's under 18, I will need to email your parents or text them just to make sure um, they're okay with me sending something to your house. And you can enter once a day, every day, um, with something else you love about yourself. we will have my Instagram and my Snapchat linked below. Comment once a day, follow me on Instagram and Snapchat for extra entries, and I will see you guys later. Remember that you're loved and more important than you know. Love you guys, bye! Welcome to the high. Make sure to press subscribe.